Hello and welcome to another tutorial from VideoEditingSoftwareGuide.com. Today we're doing a tutorial on Letterbox in CyberLake Power Director 8 Ultra. Now I've been getting a lot of questions online about how to create Letterbox for your videos in this software. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to get it done. Now the issue that people have been having is that they've been trying to create the Letterbox but with using the aspect ratio of the software they're unable to do so. So I'm going to show you why that is. So, all of these videos up here that I have are 16:9 uh, or HD videos. So if I click on it and go to set aspect ratio, you get some choices here. So if I click on the aspect ratio is 16:9, and let's say I say it's 4:3, then it's going to create letterbox. So it's going to be on the side. Everybody wants the letterbox on the top and the bottom. They don't want these side ones on here. So as you can see, I'm not able to do that by using these choices here. So let's say I try to you know manipulate the software and do it by changing the project's aspect ratio to 4.3. Okay, great. Looks like I got some letterbox on here. But it's not the answer you're looking for. Because if I leave it as is then what's going to happen is when you do all your hard work you put all your clips in, you put all your effects, your transitions, everything is done and you produce your video what will happen is you'll have the letterbox at the top and the bottom but because you're recording the whole project in 4.3 you're also going to have letterbox on the side still okay and we don't want that so I'm going to show you how to do it so first thing I want to do is make sure that I change my aspect ratio back to 16.9. I like to double check things. Now, you're going to need to have a black background. So to do that, what you want to do is you want to go to your title room and you want to click on create a new title template. Once you're here, you're going to take out any words here and you're going to give it you're going to go ahead and click OK and then what you created is a black background so I'm going to call this backdrop 2 because I already have one called backdrop in here as you can see now once you get it created you can either drag and drop it down into the title track or you can just right click it and go to add replace and it's going to put it in the title track for you now what this does is it creates a black background as you can see if there were words there you see words on the screen now the issue with the next part is getting your video in now if you put your video onto the master video track then all you're gonna see is the video because we just have a black background which will come through as nothing on here and you won't see anything because what it's supposed to do is put whatever words you have on top of the video so in order to get the black background behind the video we want to add our video clip to the picture in picture because picture in picture always shows up on top so now that we've got that in there what we need to do next is we need to modify our picture in picture video clip so that it is the correct size to create the letterbox so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and click on the clip and then we'll click on modify now when this video a window shows up we want to click on maintain aspect ratio um, we really want to uncheck that because we want to be able to manipulate it and create the letterbox so before I do that I want to make it full screen so that it it fits in everywhere All right. so now I'm going to uncheck maintain aspect ratio and I'm going to click on add edit PIP mask effect once again I'm going to uncheck maintain aspect ratio on this screen and I'm going to click on that box now I'm going to make sure that everything is out to the side all the way and I'm going to create my letterbox I'm 
by cropping these parts here. Now if I click on play to preview it, you'll see I have the letterbox. And I still have my sides. Don't have that black line all the way around. So now that I have that done, I'm going to click on OK. And there you go. Letterbox in CyberLink PowerDirector 8 Ultra. Thanks a lot. And we hope to see you again soon.